find it interesting that in less than one week's time I again find myself at a historic landmark where shots rang out. Another moment in American history. Last week I was at Kent State, today I'm in Dealey Plaza in Dallas. I'm looking straight at what was formerly called the Book Depository, where if I zoom in a little bit, up on the top floor that is supposedly where Lee Harvey Oswald was positioned when he allegedly fired the fatal shot that ended up killing President Kennedy on that November day in 1963. As I come down to the road level here on Elm Street, there's a marker right across the way that is a historic landmark that supposedly is positioned in the location, as you see the Exomilla Street, where the shots hit the president. And up the grassy small hill there is a cement pedestal where Abraham Zapruder, who had his movie camera going that day, the only known movies of the actual shooting moments, took the film that has been so analyzed through history. If I pan down a little, this is the area called the Grassy Knoll, which leads to the triple underpass, which is where the motorcade sped off to after the president was hit on the way to the hospital.